Hey folks, welcome back to Manor Lords. We are July, summer, year eight. 676 people. And about three minutes to turn this game on. This save file is taking a long time to activate. Um, last time we took Selbitz, we are now a region of five provinces. Our fiefdom is growing. As far as a name for Selbitz, we're going to concentrate on pulling the iron out of the ground and sending it over here to these weapon and armor smiths. So we named this one Gimli, Gandalf, Samwise, and Gimli. This one is a relation to Gimli. So how about we just take that literal? You ever hear the, uh, the expression Gimli, son of Gloin? Well, let's do it. <laughs> so we now have the, the province of Gloin. And we need to get this one going pretty soon because it is July and we want to get uh, them at least, you know, sub, not subsisting, surviving on their own, whatever word that is, before snow hits. But let's kind of wander around and see what's going on. Samwise has no messages. That tailor shop has been wanting a Marcus doll like forever tailor shop that would be you you and you don't have any food I know you don't have any beer why don't you have any food uh, we have five months of food we have a s way too few food stalls now I thought I set up s another market area not too long ago Kind of roaming around in here. You've always been there. I thought we set it up near here. No, because then we wandered over here. And then we wandered down over here. I kind of remember that. We put the three over here to add to those. And I was debating whether or not to put it in here. But then I remember saying, but this building looks pretty good over there. That we don't need another one. But it's the right size and shape. And then something happened and I never got back to it. <laughs> I think that's the case. They've never taken these trees down. Interesting. I remember asking them to. Unless that was in some other life. You guys, I remember saying, where are you headed? Well, you don't know. Okay. Advanced. I wanted you guys to come over here. I know it might have been in take two last time. Remember, I, I uh, let's see, what am I doing here? Control. I think that's when it was. I had done this set up for this war over here and then sent him a letter and everything just kind of stopped and he wouldn't attack and we just kind of sat there twiddling our thumbs so I had to record it all over again so that's probably when I did that I had told these guys to clear this out so that we could see this entrance into town a lot better to decide would it look weird to have a marketplace right here when there's some over there already or should there be some kind of a of a nice building as you're walking into this boulevard I mean the church a little closer to here might have been even better so got this road in here we need to get rid of the trees what goes in here where does the marketplace go burgage plots are happening and what goes in here what's a nice building that would look good nestled into these trees yeah these do need to come down I think they do. We're, we're kind of losing the view of our nice long row of, of tier threes. Yeah, that may have to be surgically removed. Um, we can't put another marketplace in here. You... I don't think we can. Uh, there. You're in a road or something. You don't... We really don't like it. Let's go with this corner. And this corner. You, what is going on? I got the right thing, right? Marketplace. It's not snapping to any corners. That's what's odd. Normally, like here, it snaps and snaps. Over here, there's no sense of that. Interesting. So it's not going to let me even try. Wild. Over here, we, we're snapping. Build it from this corner to that corner. The snaps don't seem to exist over here. Huh. Okay. Well, over there is not a thing. Where can we put some more? Let's make that decision later. Let's just stick some over here. Just to... Yeah, well, there's five there. Over in this area makes sense. Right in here. Alright. You... 
leave that tree, come on over to there, do a little diamond thing like that, and there's five, there's four, let's make you a little shorter. There's four. Okay, put two over there, make the tailor happy, or somebody happy. I hope they kind of move around. I, I notice these guys go uh, abandoned for no apparent reason once in a while. I'm hoping it's because they picked a spot that's closer and they abandoned the further one, then someone over there might then grab that space eventually. I mean, these that are abandoned, if you watch them over the long term, maybe it's when the supplies finally go away, but over the long term, they uh, they eventually do rebuild and someone else sets up some another shop there. Taxes have increased. We are getting close to the 700 mark, which to me is an accomplishment. Other people look at that and say, oh man, they're going to tax us that much? That means you know, we've become a bona fide fiefdom here, I tell you. The more taxes you pay, the more grand you are. Um, so, Gandalf has two extra people only and has... Oh, red zeros, red zeros. Where am I going to even find those? Yeah. You guys? Right there. I guess I have to be a lot closer. So we have only two homes to move into over there. Um, we were going to put in more homes over here. I don't know if that's truly necessary now. I mean, we do want to kind of fund this, but that's going to run out at some point. And most of the clay, the iron is going to be coming out of these two. I don't think we're going to use that point to boost that one. So putting more houses over there doesn't make much sense. Do we need a lot more houses over here? We maybe don't. Maybe we're good. Could be. Let's just leave Gandalf alone. Let's evaluate Samwise. We're in August. I'm going to pause because i got things, a lot of things to do before harvest happens. And time is happening faster than I can get all my words out. Um, this area needs to go into a major harvest. How are we at, by the way? 80s. Over here, we're 82s. Back over there, 80s. So we're going to go well into September this time. And even then, we're not really going to be at 100%. These got planted a little bit late last time because we were so ambitious and pushed it so hard. Some of them just barely got planted by November. So we got more stuff in the ground, but we're not going to get as much benefit out of it. So there is an advantage to not over planting you know, based or in proportion to the number of people you have. Now we do have four farms this time, so we can have 24 families handling all this. Eventually we'll go for 30 families, but we're not going to get into early harvest, so that's not a thing. We have five families over here. How are we doing as far as, well, let's just think about other things. The, let's hit this, you four, you three are done. Zero of three, one of four, you're right here. You're making herbs, though you're not actually making herbs. Let's pull you out, you're done. And, no, berries are still happening. Oh, okay. And we're in August. 29 berries left. One family can handle that. You're fine. Okay. Granary does have someone in there pulling the bat berries out of these huts slowly and as well as running a, a booth somewhere. So that's fine. Meat. We are at 14. There should be one family in there doing that. That's fine. Malt is over here. Two families are doing that. Converting 57 barley left into malt, malt, malt. There you are. 63 malt left. Converting into 109 ale. Everything over 50 is being shipped out to the other regions, other provinces. So that's working great. Uh, converting flax. These guys here, Weaver Shop, two of them. Making linen. Linen, linen, 37. Making yarn, 29. So 50 some flax and 144 wool. Which is coming in great. We're. Our, our sheep over here, which we don't really spend much time thinking about. Put another one in here so we can get wool in even faster. We have one tailor making clothes. And clothes, where are we at? Right there. We actually have, we're ahead on clothes now. And over here in Gandalf, we are barely ahead of clothes. Cloaks, we're at 25. 
and cloaks were at zero. So we're ahead on clothes. Rather than get a second tailor going like in Gandalf, let's just switch you over and start making cloaks out of the wool that we've got, the yarn. Now, dyes, we have dyes. Berries, we don't have a lot of berries. Food, we're okay. We're going to use up our berries into dyes. We do have bread, eggs, and vegetables as well. And did we ever solve where the animals went in this province? Every time we've gone in here, I've seen only one or two. It claims that we've got 14. And last time it was questionable if they're actually in this area. I do see one over here. Two. Okay. Three. Yeah, they're all over here now. So here is not quite in the bullseye, but not too far away. All right, that's acceptable. And our deer, we did see those starting to move away. Do we get a sense of run where you went? I don't see them anymore. So I wonder, I've never spent enough time to truly, there's so many being hauled away. I wonder if the game knew that those were the next ones to be hunted. Oh, we got one down over here. Must be a hunter on his way in to take them. Okay. Are they truly moving? Actually, it's all of them now. Okay, I was wondering if the three or four of the, whose hunters were on their way were moving forward. He just... Oh, he just got shot. Okay, I was going to say, whoa. <laughs> He's playing the role. He just fell over. <laughs> you are rocks. Okay. Anyway, enough rambling on for those two. We've got Gandalf kind of figured out. We've got... I think we've got Samwise figured out enough. All the important stuff seems to be going. Uh, one more check here. Clay is 54. Let's build that up a little bit higher. And roofing tiles are at 600. Let's just work on clay some more. Roofing tiles are fine. And we just can't seem to sell them fast enough. Okay, maybe that's what we need to be working on then. Let's pull you two back out and ensure that our traders are maxed out and doing their thing. And you guys do not need to be doing that. So please stop that. Okay, you're there. You're off. You're there. And you are there and you're off okay so you guys are all doing that and trading is happening i hope it's happening so people stocking goods transporting mounting horse um one more time livestock only one and advance we are calling for another one okay so waiting for that to happen you guys people we've got stocking up stocking guiding an ox for some reason and trading and mounting a horse so those seem proper and over here stocking up mounting a horse stocking up tradings stocking up goods okay trading seems to actually be happening over here now one family left to do things let's verify trading over here then we get over to Gimli then we'll start working with Gloin and I am running again let's, let's do that people going somewhere and going home dropping off resources dropping off resources waiting and carrying a rider Carrying a rider. Okay, I'm I'm at a loss. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, I'm I'm just waiting for half wit Brits. Um, I don't know, broke back trader comment to come rolling in or something. Now, uh, okay, let's let's just let's just move on. <laughs> All right, so Gimli, save me. Over here, six families available. And again, I'm going to pause. I want to be working on a new settlement over there before September hits. So there's not enough time left this summer. Um, trading. Let's just see what trading's looking like over here. And can we boost it? Funds are looking great over here. So trading is a good thing. Trade, advance. We have two over here. And it does. you're carrying a rider too. Okay, I'm, apparently we're trading people now. I, yeah, that's that's actually kind of wild. Um, one more family in, people. So going homes and waitings. This is all not looking very good. Take everybody out, put everybody back in, reset your jobs, think about your life, and see how this goes. Advance asking for two more. They have not arrived yet. You guys 
are there's nobody here. Okay, load you guys up completely. And that was a save? Yeah. And if I do this, do we have stocking up goods, mounting a horse, mounting a horse? Though you don't have horses. Interesting. So, in other words, it may be like the pack station system in that they kind of pool the horses between them. They do that. A pack station doesn't have horses, yet they'll be out there riding mules just fine. Uh, someone else's. Okay, you get one more. I've got to pull a family out of somewhere. People, you are trading goods and waiting, mounting a horse, and trading. So it's just the middle two families are questionable. But I can't click on you and say you two go away. Yeah, so it doesn't do me any good. Um, let's see. So I'm going to have to leave you alone. I need one family from somewhere to do something else. You are down to two people. You are down to two people. You are down to one. There's anybody left over here. There is one over here. And there are no berries. Let's just pull you out and say thank you for your service. And you are done. Okay. You're doing that. I know I have raided the the slabs the bloomeries of people has it hurt us uh, over here yep it has so we've got to get more people into here and there goes trading again and we're going to need to steal everybody for the harvest here real soon how are we doing in the, this area we are at 93 and we are at 94 so september's going to work out just right over here um let's pull back on here by another two families and add two families into the bloomeries and see if that helps us out now i had put one in each thinking that way they can't overwhelm the storage but i wonder if two each would help each other keep stock you know so one family stocking goods charcoal and and iron ore while another family stays there and just keeps working so there is a possibility i have seen two families though overwhelm the uh, the 50 storage but if I were to pull you and put you in here, let's try that for a while. Three of two and see if that doesn't improve our efficiency somehow. Okay, so many dried up bushes. Ah, that's what it is. All right. Gimli, no storage space left in the saw pit. We were... That wasn't the saw pit. We were waiting for that to happen, too. You are... We're just going to run these guys until they filled up and then pull them out. Okay, so that's a stable. You are this one. We'll just pull you out. We'll pull the other one soon. Okay, let you guys run. Let's quickly get a settlement over here. Boy, everything looks brown. Looks gray. Looks like it is at the, the heat, the dead of summer. Everything is dried up. Look at these plains out here. This is wild. Now, so I was watching uh, Simidium today, and he was talking about taking essentially, yeah, one of these two provinces himself and debating what, which one to, to go with because he was debating what happens if we start building right here and then they're attacked from here now he may be in a different orientation like that or something but then he's, he's maybe kicking around just going for the center of the map just to give more time for that new settlement that third settlement to have time to to you know be defended by these other ones because they're further away i've got that same issue do we want to build the town over here so that Gimli will have time to come and defend, and Gandalf will have time to come and defend, should this be attacked. Which I don't see why he wouldn't be attacked. We, we, uh, you know, we just poked him in the eye, so I would imagine we're going to start seeing random attacks come in. But what he's going to be doing is over here. Those are the uh, important ones. We'll run this one out till it's gone, and Clay, I guess we could start sending Clay over as well, but... Am I paused? Yeah, let's stay paused while I'm reasoning through things. But this is the primary goal, and then they need to feed themselves. And it would all happen so much more efficiently if it was all right here, which means they're very possibly going to be attacked. So maybe I just need to position a retinue in there 
that makes sense. Let's stay paused for a moment and do that. Let's grab Gandalf's retinue. Let's paint you with three more people at 50 apiece. Two, three. And we'll just we'll literally paint you guys right now. You guys are green and gold and green all the way through. So, like so, and gold and green. And we need to upgrade you with one of the 27 plate armors that we brought in, and you're ready. So let's wipe these out as well. Yellows in there. Greens. And you. One more. Yellows. No, you're greens. Yeah, now do this 48 times like I did the other day. <laughs> yellow! Yellow! <laughs> <laughs> oh, my fingers were numb when I was finished with that job. You're there, and then I, I like the bird beak, and that shield, so that's correct. That one is almost correct, so helmet, you're back one, and the shield is correct, and you are four, two, three, four, there you are, and block right there. And weapons, I just left them to be random. Because that was just one more. Oh, body. I also want... Oh, those are correct, but you're supposed to be green. That's what was wrong. Okay, so you guys are up and running. Let's rally you. And get you up and running. And everyone run out. Looking good over here. We have a lot of building materials yet to clean up. Yeah, so you're probably one of the ones that says generic storage is full. Because you get logs in your generic storage. But let's grab these guys and bring them over to the new province. And let them just stand guard over here. So you guys are headed for... Where? You are the vanguard over here. That didn't work. Click. And... Click. And... Well, oh, it's the other click. All right, right mouse button. And we'll just double you up. You guys can sit over here. All right, so that is a thing. That helps me to be willing to put the town in this area. At least one troop is in place and can begin the defense while the others are arriving. So we then need out of this 1,300, which is really just 600, really. Six to 700. And once this is paid off, oh, we have another year to pay it. 340. Okay, so we've got we've got a good thousand to mess with there. Um, you are here, administration. Yeah, a settler's camp. And you go where? Can you go on the sh on the steep grade? You cannot. Okay, nothing else can either. Except this would be great for burgage plots. If we can get the house to mount down here, the the grounds work the the gardens can be up there this is very flat look at that i can see with the contours we're a, a flat valley between two uh, and then we have the, the steep hill over here where our battle was so this is the center of town interesting so let's put you guys maybe off over here do something like that and i wish i could choose a mining village but that's not a thing yet we're going to stick with modest we want to save our our funds for other things and confirm okay you're up and running and let's give you your your basic settlement figured out here and then we'll start everything up and get it running so right off the bat logistics i want another another uh stable over here and we want trees probably out of here this is probably all of our forested you know the the, uh, the logging and the firewood in this area we won't touch this area so as not to disturb anything. Um, we do have good hunting, though, over here. <laughs> we have Gandalf's hunting. Where are you guys at now? This is Gandalf, right? Pull back. No, it's not. It's over here. So we have... We have Gandalf's deer over in our region here. I'm just looking to see if those guys are still moving. All right, we always see them move, and then I never see them again. Never see them settling into a new area they're always right back here again almost like as soon as the camera loses focus on that area they just reset Shh, don't tell anybody sneak back over here now um 
So let's put you up in this area. Um, on a slope a little bit. Right in there. And let's put logging up in this area. And spin you around. Your entrance is kind of like that. Let's get rid of the snap. And drop you in. Uprooting one right there. We'll take you right there. And firewood's got to be up in this area as well. So that is... Look at the symbol, you. A um, little bit different spot. Actually, you could be focused over here. You could. Uh, your entrance, firewood, firewood. It's kind of like that. I guess it is. Okay. So tuck you into here. Right there. Yeah, I think so. So you're in that area. And then we need a supplies are over here. Let's just put supplies over here. I didn't even bother to check the uh, fertility. I didn't think there was much. And we have a little bit right there. Uh, emmer, flax, and barley are going to be nothing. So in case we do want to throw a little something in here, I don't think we will. But in case we do, we'll go ahead and... What happened? This is... We still have a bloody battle scene over here. Wow. I didn't expect that. Our own flag bearers over here. Wow, I didn't expect that. Boy, that 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 caught me off guard. Yeah. Um I hate to say it that way, but they might increase the fertility over here. <laughs> but wow, that's yeah, that that was not expected. I thought I was looking at at Gandalf's um uh, retinue and something went wrong and they were they spawned in or something really weird but okay wow yeah this is puts it into perspective this was a hard fought and won region it really was wow okay so i need to get these goods into an under a roof these goods figured out where they belong and so let's put in the granary nearby thinking about foods but also thinking about berries so really this guy goes over here but i guess in reality he goes th there could be two of them sure so you are off like so and let's just put this guy off like so as well well that's not where i wanted him but that's where the click happened okay so you guys are there and what does that do for us with one log left um what else is vital? None of you guys, you're all taken care of over here. Uh, well, food is vital. Food will be next, but that's probably once the the this guy gets done. So you're the highest priority. Let's get you going, and families are here. Our first ten are here, and they're going to get started on that. we got our first ox. Someone's going to be grabbing you. She is, Beatrix. And that's a start. Okay, pull away. And we're back over here. Let them just do their thing. So there's nothing happening over here. It's growing dark. It is. It looks like it's darkening up. I can hear winds. So... In that case... I do want... This guy built next. Highest also. Maybe they'll split... Their... Their, uh, their families. You know, four or five over there... Four or five over here. I'm hearing a roaring, a rumbling noise. I guess it's the fire. Though now I don't hear it. But right up in here, there's kind of a, a low rumble. Like there was a forest fire somewhere in the distance. That's what it kind of felt like. Yeah, we're going to need a burial pit. We really are. So this region over here, what is it telling us? We have five families of homelessness. We have exposed goods. And we have exposed goods. It's not telling us there are bodies to bury. They happened before there was actually a town here. So maybe the game doesn't register it. But I really hate to waste their labor burying bodies. Yeah. These will eventually despawn. I mean, they're, that's the reality of the situation. It's just we're, we know they're here. They aren't acting like they know they're here. 
So, yeah. I can't preset any more buildings. I would love to get all this preset, get the mine set in place, get this mine in here and get that mined out. 120 stone sent off into the system. But, and you guys, I probably never set you to not run. And now you are... You're not running anymore because you're flat out exhausted. Yellow bar is at the at the end. Yeah. Anyway, so what else has been happening around here? We've got August hit. We've got treasury. And a lot of treasury. Oh, these are the, th the three upgraded retinue. Okay. And that is the... Okay, so... When August hit, that's it over here. 18, 118 and 163. And 8. Because Samwise is flat broke. Yeah. So it's a percentage off of that. All right now it would be 24. Okay. Um, and for over here, generic storage, storage is full. And that is a log issue. Yeah. Um, over in here, any warnings? No, just same kind of stuff. Yep, logs in storage, and everybody wants wants beer, and that's understandable. You guys, 40 of 40, we've got 10 hunters now, no, 8 hunters now, 8 hunting families. So there's a lot of meat rolling in, it's just taking a long time to get it here. So, and there's not much in the way of construction happening. So I guess what we're going to do, who's got the most... Um, we got two carcasses in limbo over there. One there. You can just go away. Demolish you. And I want to make sure that all, all of you guys do not say um, set up a stall. Because it's too far away for you to walk. So that's a no, no, and no. We, what I'm getting at is we, we might need 20 hunters. Now, Gandalf's version of Samwise's harvest season is Gandalf's hunting season, Put if you want to word it that way. So it's you, you, you're up and running, and the third one over here is, I know there's three of you, and I almost built all of you into the berries, that's right. You're at zero there. So you've got one, well, I lost you right there in limbo. So let's stock you up. You can get that one and then continue on. And we'll just kind of do it this way. Now this says hunting limit of 10. That did transfer over to all of them, right? It's not a manual thing. Is that a global thing? It is. So when you change one, you change them all. Okay. So I'll take you down to 10 animals, but that's never going to happen anyway. So that's not a problem. Um, so it's that rain never happened. Yeah, it was just kind of a... A darkness that started to settle in for some reason. Maybe it has to do with the, the heat of summer. We never got to notice that there was a drought going on, right? The droughts don't give us an, an audible noise that I've ever noticed. Nothing ever gets my attention. So I never know when we're in trouble in that regard. And that can really drop your, your uh, forecasted yield. Yield of zero. Eight of zero. What does that mean? That's interesting. 14 of 0. 12 of 0. I've never seen those numbers reversed. 13 of 0. Is it saying you're done? Sewing is done. No. Growth is not done. What does the 13 of 0 mean? Interesting. I honestly don't know. 14 is... Normally it's, you know, 14 of, of 17. We're almost there. So that's... Unusual? Huh. Fill me in if I'm just going brain dead and not getting that. But that seems odd to me. So we're waiting for September to happen here. Um, so everything here is fine. Over in... Are we in Gimli here? We are. Two families are left available. There wasn't any more construction to do. So they're most likely running oxen. Oxen. So over here, six oxen. Uh, we don't need them for farming. Whatever happened to the oxen count over here? We need eight. And over here, we have ten. Okay. So we're doing fine there. And I never know if we have enough um, space. Ah, 
15 of 17, but it seems like it counts the farms now as stable space. And I know it counted the... Well, they were living in the livestock for a while. Yeah, there's stable space there. So let's let's just throw a few more stables in this area before uh, harvest begins, just to make sure that we're not uh, not messing anything up here. So let's get many. Yeah, we could, even if, if we're not going to use them. You're over here. When you're waiting to be built, you are built, and we need to upgrade you and take you up. You did get done. You did. So you're ready to take oxen in for plowing. Okay. Um, I suppose I could get that happening, right? If I were to set you... Let's see how our fertility is looking. Uh, I was already there. You would be flax over here. We're looking good again. Everything has come back. Let's set you for flax. And we're not going to use crop rotation. If I were to do this and then hire up the first eight, could we already get this part going. I'm pretty sure I can. So you're all flax now. If I were to advance and hit it again and do that, get you going, and put eight families in here. And then I think I'll do the hold on. Let me let me set all these and turn them on. We can get the plowing started right now. And then they'll automatically drop into harvesting as soon as September 1 gets here. So that seems like a good preemptive uh, plan. Hold on. All right, so that's those turned on. And I wanted to check one more thing. It's something we, we were questioning a couple episodes back. These are supposed to be barley. And we had run out the barley fertil fertilizer. And I wanted to know if I used this for emmer, which it was, you know, fully fertile for emmer, would it continue to rebuild the barley fertilizer level while it was being used for emmer? And let's see here, barley, it did. These are all, you know, the three pluses instead of two pluses. So it did rebuild it, even though we are growing other crops in there. So we can cycle back and forth. So these, Samwise, let's pause a minute. These could be constantly growing then. One year barley, one year wheat back and forth and never have to follow these fields out because it does treat the two fertilities as two separate things uh emmer so that's cool so these guys are all set and as they harvest them we will reset the harvested ones for potentially a second round a second crop but i want to get over here real quick to gloin before any more time goes by because let's see here you did get done so one, two families in there. Did you get done? You are being done right now. So a few more taps and it's going to be done right for our eyes, right? Come on, guy. Hit that hammer. Tap, tap, tap. Lawrence. Lawrence. Come on. <laughs> Dude, you're right there. <laughs> are you having a moment here? You're unassigned. Yeah, that means you're a builder. Because... Els yelled from off in the distance, don't you hit that last peg? It's my peg. Okay, thank you. Uh, wait a minute. Now, now we're waiting for... Oh, what? Guys. Guys. <laughs> Are we really one log short? That can't be. You're just bringing the last log over. That's a lot of building for uh, missing a log. Gotta say. Uh-huh. That's a neat little building. It's wet all off the ground. So it's it's off of the moisture, you know, seeping up from below. Maybe it's higher up where, I don't know, I don't think rats would have any trouble getting up there. But I'm guessing moisture is the reason. Huh. But here's Lorenz. He's finally going to finish the job here. Tap, tap, tap so I can assign somebody. And you guys can all get to work on the next thing. Perfect. Let's get two people in there and just get the job done real quick. And then we will take you back out of there. Storehouse. Does that need to be next? Highest? Let's think about that. What else is there? Um, this guy. Let's get an ox into here. Get that going. There's no upgrading yet until we get planks. That'll be in this area somewhere. It'll be 
a year or two before this is fully functioning and bringing all of the iron ore across. So it's just going to be, it's always a slow process. You just have to not take it for granted and realize it's, it's just as important as setting up the very first uh, town. Oh, they finally figured out there's bodies to be buried. There's two. So we must have gotten close to a couple of them. Or there are two others. Will it tell me where? You know, it's, 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 it, they, they can see these guys. Yeah. Okay. Um, well, you know, we're going to need a burial plot somewhere eventually. We are. But I hate to waste someone to that. Um, burial plot, family request, more market stalls, and glowing. Oh, and glowing. Yeah, you, you would, wouldn't you? Where are the houses going to go here? I wandered them up the hill. Can we do that? Let's grab H for house. We're very steep here. Can we do something like this? Like that. It does seem to let us, right? If there's no goods, but it's not saying too steep. So I'm thinking the houses can be low, and the plots, the 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 uh, backyards, the gardens can be up here. Okay, let's do that. We're not gonna have any big vegetable gardens at this point because we uh, we need. We, we can't have that many people dedicated to gardening at the moment. We have a lot of building and a lot of, of growth to do here at the very beginning. So that's kind of a second phase. We're still waiting for September to hit. Otherwise, we are people, we are guiding an ox. We're debranching trees. There's the ox. We're taking out. I haven't set an area. So you're just going to clear this area here. And it might be nice to go a little bit deeper. So advanced, and let's, let's set a good work area, though. Good size one. You guys can just have the whole forest. I don't see any reason why you can't even take out into the other regions a little bit. So you guys just have a ball. You do that area. Eventually, we may have someone else working this forest over here. And did we... You guys are not crucial yet, so we're not the highest priority. We're fuel... We don't have any fuel consumption yet. Okay. So if houses are going to go over here, and we do need to get that going or they will grow hungry. Though I th I'm pretty sure they can go right to the granary. We saw that in Gimli. They went right to the granary and got food. So that's not as big of an issue just yet. Um, how best to get food over here, though? Logs. If there's four, I guess we do need to just get started over in here. So we are running, we're running slow, good. We've got berries, berries are deep. Berries are deep. So we're gonna need another granary over here. Let's get that set up. You, gonna be a granary, and we won't worry about another storehouse. We'll get the granary going in here, uh, like so. And let's road across the front of you. Pause. Okay, someone just realized that uh, we don't have a lot of goods. Okay, so you're going to come into here, kind of snake your way through the woods, and make your way through the trees and over into this berry area. Let's be careful about where we're going. The berries are over here. Okay, we'll stop there, and we'll branch off little further around like that as well okay so let's get the first um, berries right there in this area spin you around like so you're up in there road is also over here okay so it's just a matter of where can I go and not take out a bunch of trees I think I think you're here four trees Alright, so the best we can do is one tree. We'll just do that. And road you. Ah, don't even need to road you. Okay, so you're there. Let's get hunting in this area as well. You're like so. And you're really close to that. So I'm going to take you more. Into here. We'll sacrifice some trees. Two. One. We'll do that. You're right there. Alright, so get you guys built and 
berries, well, we, they're going to, it's only 64, they're not growing anymore, but may as well get that going. So you were over here, you are the next highest one. You need to get going. Okay. So once the food is picked up, then we can, is it? It is. So we have 15 food in here, or there about seven left. Ooh, okay. So you can set up a stall, and I believe, where are you people at? You're all over here doing nothing. Okay, so general, you guys all shut down. I need to set up a market. Uh, you housing market, and may as well just kind of make it right in here. You to you, to you, to you. All right, there's a market. And before I forget, let's road kind of up into here and road right up between these trees. Okay, I like that. So we have access up into that area. I've blocked all this off pretty good. Um, so you guys are okay for a while. You're hurting on supplies, but you'll eventually get it figured out. You guys don't set up booths, do you? No. So the firewood does. The storehouse does. One family in there. You guys pull the, the stone and what have you in there. And this is one month of food left. How do we get food in here to help them out? What can we, pause a minute, what can we do? I can send food in exchange for something. What is the something? That's the hard part. They got nothing to trade. If I get firewood going, then we can trade firewood. It's a long walk, but it gives us a trading good. And I can then trade from, with pack stations from Gandalf, grab their firewood and drop off bread or drop off meat. Okay, let's, yeah, let's do that. Two families, and we're trying to get berries going, and we're trying to get firewood going. Okay, that's a thing. And you guys, now that we have a clue what's going on, why don't you guys come over here and and uh, just kind of say hi, kind of mill around in here, and, and uh, yeah, be, be friendly. All right. We still, burial is not there anymore. We're probably starting to uh, despawn. Um have despawned have despawned okay that's a done thing all right still in august and we are back to gimli i am wow over well over 40 minutes into the episode okay um we were in samwise and i never really got this going i didn't get back to you oh all that work for nothing okay well let's just let's just get this going um I need two families in each at the very least, so grab you and back you off to three, and you, three, and you, three, and you, three, and let's livestock you, get plows into each of them. That's the hard part about running three towns, let alone four towns. I'm trying to keep track of everything simultaneously. And I need people. So where do I find people right now? Um, wood is where I usually start. Well, well, we can pull you down to two. We'll do that. Hunting, I don't want to touch. Berries are done, and we have already raided. No, we didn't. So take you... They're done. Okay, so we take you out. Large granary. I can leave one in there and leave three in here. You guys are done by now. Grain, you guys are done by now. You're out. Communal oven, Samwise. We did take the bakery perk, didn't we? So communal oven is no longer a thing. Did I... I want to say I set a bakery. It was one of these houses here, and I was debating whether I wanted another one. Okay, so you are now bakers. And general, you have made bread. Perfect. That was a big rumble. You hear that? No, it's a bunch of motorcycles outside my building. Okay. Yeah, I live on a on a main road, and I think a whole uh, <laughs> whole bunch of motorcycles just went by. That was quite a rumble. Um. Yeah, blew my mind there. Did we want a second bakery? We did get a second bakery. We are baking in two different bakeries now. You guys are no longer a thing. 
So I'll pull you out and I'd say make you go away. Though we've got all this going on, so I'll leave that alone until it's emptied, naturally. Okay, small stable. Um, I don't need, well, we do have one family running a stable over here to kind of maintain this area. You are running, you're fine, okay. So looking for more families. And we're into August. By the time I figure this all out, it'll be September. So where do I find more families? I put one more in here to help pull in more wool. We are done here. Trade. Asking for 12. Don't have them yet. Asking for another horse. Don't have it yet. So we're not done here. Okay. Are we over here? You guys. Whatever happened to you guys? Still waiting for folks to move into there. Okay. That's fine. Uh, food here is eight months. So we're not hurting in this area. Okay. Uh, clay is at 58 we're at two families let's take you down to one and i know we're we don't need to be running this guy at all anymore because we have way too many roofing tiles although it was 600 when we started so we have sold off some we're at a thousand coins over here uh firewood in this area we've got six months let's take everyone out of firewood there is a save or some kind of a stutter pull you out Pull you out uh, right there. I don't have any gray question marks telling me that they've already chopped their areas dry. And there's one over here. Pull you out. Okay. There's six families. Let's get farm, farm, farm. You're over here. Let's go ahead and get you loaded up first. You're going. And I guess you guys are kind of next. I, let's, I guess let's just do it all. We're, we're in September now. In fact, let's just pause. I want to get as much advantage out of this as I can this time. So I need all these families here. You're there. And you guys are there too. All right. Everybody gets fired now. No more dilly-dallying around. You guys are gone. The tavern has nobody in it. Trading posts, I guess, stripped down to half manpower right there. You're doing that. I don't know what how many trades I just uh, sacrificed by doing that, but I need everyone on the harvest. Nobody in the church. Um, what else is there? You guys come out. You guys come out. We're not going to be doing any building anyway. Need to go till I have one family there. Hunting, I don't want to touch. You guys are tanning. Tanning has hides, leather. Okay, forager. Forester, take you out. There was another forester somewhere. It was the one that I moved up in this area. You, you, I never put anybody in there. Okay. Who's left? Who is left? Corpse Pit is out this way somewhere. You're nobody. And I feel like there's still one more industry I can raid somewhere. What am I thinking of? Sheep Farm, I feel like I've got to have at least one person in there. It just seems required. We definitely have to have somebody in there. Uh, this area, that's what's left. Weavers are out. Malt is probably done. Dyers are done. And you are a stable. You are a farmhouse. Okay. So malt, where are you at? We're still at zero. Malt. Um, barley. Barley, that one. We're essentially done anyway. There's, there's not much left. Okay. So that's there, and I have two families left. Okay. Then let's put one back into malt. And we filled all of our farms. All right, so you guys are going to start the work. We've got to harvest everything. We've got to start plowing these other fields. We've got to choose fields that get harvested for a, an alternate crop into that same space. And the small army has been released. Okay, pause again. Let's let's do a small army over here as well. So you are now going to be wheat, and always checking to see that there's a percentage in there still. Wheat. Okay, and you guys are as well. And I guess I should... Actually, all I need to do is just get you going. So, eight families into here. And I can turn it back on. You can already start to, to do your thing. You are going to be wheat. And you. And then I need to evaluate and see if there is a possibility that any of these can be run a second year. That answer is no. There's a lot of red in there. Okay, so that is it for that. And I need some more families. So that means what? Iron ores, 23 iron slabs are zero. We can't raid that system. 
We've got 135 charcoal. We're going to raid you guys. So one out of there, one out of there, and we'll take you as well. And that's zero. So what can I do to get one more? You are firewood. Let's leave you in there. Bare minimum firewood coming in. Is there firewood on this side still? You hunting. One in there, none in there, and firewood's over here, none in there. Okay, I don't think I dare take any more of you. Uh, trading is probably where I can tap one family out of each, and that should do me. So you, you, and you. And we're up and running. You, there's nobody in here, and I'm not ready to use you yet anyway, right? Tab, oh, we do have our first family in there, so we're almost ready. One, two, and then one over here. Three more families moving in. And we'll be able to let the beer flow and get those up to tier threes. Great. Over in here, did you guys ever move in? You're still running beer, right? No, your tavern was off. It was just a chance. You're not ready anyway. Just a chance that when I did need to upgrade these, there was still some beer in the system. Okay. Over here, Gimli, Gandalf. Uh, there you are. Did you guys ever move in? You did not. And they're the only ones I'm waiting for, right? I think I've hit everyone else that runs a, a farm, runs a vegetable plot. Okay, so you guys over here, what did we accomplish in that amount of time? Um, I am in the right place. Firewood's over here somewhere. Firewood, firewood, here. And you are waiting for one more log. You're at highest, and you're in competition with berries. Over here, uh, I'm close, you're in. Berries, get you guys going. Uh, Gloin, construct and finish forager hut. Just happened, okay. And you guys can take those 64 out. You should be able to do that by November with no problem. You, stockpile is gone. Is gone, okay. So you can leave. Although you are my storehouse for my firewood. There is that. But, like I said, they can head over here. We are out of food. We are out of food. We are. Okay. Let's think this through. We have two people. We have logs. Eight logs. Let's get one out of here. We'll just barely maintenance mode. Get you built. Get some firewood going. And before I forget any more, let's get a pack station from over here. You have been doing something. You have not. I thought there was one that I had set up. I think I shut you down, didn't I? Let's just verify. No, no, and... And yes. You are swapping helmets for male armor. Oh, so that's how we've been able to move things. Male armor is huge over here. Let's, let's stop that. So, lots of male armor over here. Over here, we're taking all of your male armor. Um, yeah, we took all your mail armor. We gotta stop digging your mail armor. Armor over here, we... No, we don't have. Wait a minute. Let me, let me see that again. Oh, it's right here. Pack station. We are sending over helmets to Samwise, and we're taking back mail armor. That's weird. Because the mail armor is coming from Gimli. So why did I do that? I don't know. Well, let's just turn you into a Gloin and send over meats, vegetables, berries, breads, eggs. Let's send over eggs. Foods are where? There's meats, there's berries, there's eggs. Let's send over eggs and bring back firewood, which is near the bottom, I think. Down there. Okay. So we'll get that going as soon as firewood... Well, they already have firewood produced, so we can start stealing what they have already and trading it for foods. Okay. Then we'll start making our own firewood over here to replace what we got taken. So yeah, so that trade can start immediately because there's already firewood sitting right there. Perfect. And tools. Oh, we could do that too. We could do that too, and it's worth more. I'm pretty sure it is. Let's do that as well. Or do we do both? Let's give them a burst. Okay, let you run, and let's get a second family in there. You guys are going to be heading over to Gloin with something else. Breads, um, vegetables. So vegetables, where's a carrot? Where There's a carrot. You're going to be bringing back tools. Where's a big old hammer? 
No, no, I missed you somewhere. Uh, there. No, right next to it, right there. Okay, so there's two rounds of food heading that direction. And it's very good that we're able to do that for them. Otherwise, yeah, it's it's uh, brink of starvation time. Policies are available somewhere. We are still in September, so why that just popped now, I don't know. Interesting. And we're trying to get you up and running. You're a long way away. That's probably a mistake. It really is a mistake. Have you done it yet? You haven't. Let's pause you. Let's don't do that. Let's pop you nearby and make you a, a temporary camp just to get you built. I think that would be smarter. Okay, you are transporting probably to the hunting lodge. Um, let's do this a little bit wiser. I want to gather firewood from right here. Spin you like so, just set you down. Okay, you are the highest priority right now. And let's see if we can get you going in that regard. There was nobody on their way, right? There's only two oxen. And I, oh, I'm always losing this one. He's over here. I feel like I needed to have put him over there. No, but then he's too close to this stuff. He was just going to clean up this edge. Yeah, you are a backup plan. You're not going to be the primary. We just don't have the luxury of, of dealing with that distance right now. We did that with Gimli. Trying to save this forest by logging over here. And that failed miserably. And yeah, of course, I made the same mistake again. Okay, you guys, do we ever get a, a full farm of eight uh, farm of eight there we go got you and you're fine you're stripping all this down and we're going to follow you out as soon as that's done so i need to keep an eye on that and I need to do the same thing over here what has been stripped should be a lot of things that have been stripped though you're actually i see you aren't just going like, like a wave of locusts stripping one field out at a time you're each Two or three of you at a time are picking your own field. Interesting. So as soon as I can say fallow. Alright, so let's 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 look at the fertilities over here. You flax. Okay. You're no good for flax. Are you good for barley? See, we could barley in here. Or even emmer in here. And then we can switch back to flax next time. Yeah. I could overwhelm these 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 farmers with something in every field every single year in that regard we can rotate crops that is interesting okay maybe we can get back into crop rotation at that point although there's only three three is awkward three is awkward so if it could be if I could get rid of one of those and either do two or four then I could just say you know emmerflax 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 and just keep it going and it switches in October, but there are so many fields now over here that we don't have to worry about them replanting the wrong thing because they they got so much harvesting to do. Okay. Um, verify everything. Livestock, yes. Families, yes. And did this ever happen? You're being upgraded. Highest one family to do the work. Okay. Uh, next farm over here. Eight families two oxen and we're good next farms over here eight families two oxen just looking to see what that was something popped over there and another farm over here eight families and two oxen we are plowing or waiting for a guide or hauling things in from the fields so everything here is working fine Running nice and slow. I'm probably well, well past that hour mark. Alrighty. Well, I guess we're going to call that one done. You guys have got your start. We've got two and a half months, right? October, November, and half of September before snow hits. So we're good there. You have been taken out, and you need to get put in. And hunting does not necessarily need to get put in. Let's leave our two, three families to do what they need to do. Okay, so with that, I'm going to call this one done. Thanks for watching, folks, and I'll catch you later. Bye-bye now. Oh.